Advanced Steel is a grade that's used and loved by many for its simplicity and efficiency. But despite its long history, it still lacks some features that could improve the usability and overall performance. I have worked for more than 7 years at Grytek, and more than 10 years I was using Advanced Steel. Recently I became an independent developer and inferred a number of useful tools for Advanced Steel. I have compiled those features into the Titan application. In this overview I will talk briefly about the problems this tool solves and how to use it. There are no tools in Advanced Steel that allow you to color categorize elements in a model according to any specific criteria. In Titan you will find a number of commands that solve these problems. You can mark out elements by section types. That way they will be assigned to the layers and the layers will be colored in different ways. This can be useful when analyzing the structure. Another tool allows you to group items by assemblies and rows. They are also arranged in layers and colors. This makes it possible to get a much better structure of the object tree in Nevisworks. With this tool you can quickly return everything to its original state and remove unnecessary layers. This tool assigns model elements into groups by row. This is useful for starting processes to create drawings for checking model quality and for assigning prefixes to rows. By the way, how do you know which group an element is in? Perhaps it is several groups at the same time. It is funny, but Advanced still doesn't have the simple feature. This is simplest command I have ever written and this button simply identifies which group the element is in. In Advanced still connections there are sometimes parts in which the material change property is locked. Also. If you select multiple items and at least one of them has locked material, then the change is locked in the whole set. But what's most annoying is that material is locked in any slave joints. If you use them, it becomes very difficult to change material for a group of elements. Titan has tools that allow you to change the locked material for plates, beams, gratings and even bolts. This is no longer a problem. How to find objects with the same cross section in the model? By using a query, but this will require quite a lot of action. I have a simple find similar button for you. It highlights profiles with the same cross sections in the model. Now you can quickly replace them. It also works with plates of the same thickness if you select a plate. If you click the Show All button in Advanced Steel, a bunch of objects appear that you don't need. You have to disable them one by one with filters, but for some objects there are no filters at all. For example, for work planes, the solution is a simple filter that will select all the material objects. Another strange thing about Advanced Steel is that you can't quickly see the content of the assembly. There is one way but it will consist of a lot of steps, sometimes it's easier to create a drawing. With Titan it's a one button operation. You quickly get all the information you need about an assembly in a table, without the need to apply filters or create drawings. You need information about the assemblies in the model, no problem. individual parts or total weight by section type. Information about drawings and views, here you go. Titan also allows you to create lists and specifications on selected sheets. I will tell more about it in one of the next Titan Pro version videos, since those functions, in my opinion, should already be present in the advanced steel functionality. I dedicated to make them free for all users. Visit our website and just download the Titan installer for advanced steel 2020 or 2021 and use all the tools I described in this video for free. In the next video I will talk about the pro version of 
of my application, which has even more powerful tools. See you then!